Okay, and as quickly or more quickly than it came, it will go. It is strike day. The last day of the show was last night. The matinee on Sunday was 2 p.m. Monday morning, bright and early. Uh, we just finished the set in time for the Friday opening night. I did a Saturday show, and like I said yesterday, and now it goes back to nothing, which is kind of a beautiful thing, almost like those sand mandalas, but everything's kind of stowed in its pseudo uh, location from, you know, doing the show itself. Maybe I could turn the work lights on and see this. Now this piece is over in here. Boudoir is here. Hard to see. I'm going to get some nice final photographs, but um, basically this was the state of everything that went out. We've got our latches kind of painted in and hidden in the trim. Uh, here, wainscoat and chair rail. This is the A side of the stairs. Came out pretty nice with a light dry brush just to pull up some of these uh, highlights on top. So what I did was everything got this color brown and then when we were finished with that and it was almost time to open the curtain, I made, I had to put a dab of white in that same color, made a highlight color and just ran around and caught the top of everything. But um, then our B side that's just smooth brown, which faces out for Fester going to the moon. So you kind of don't notice that he's going upstairs in the dark when he's under a spotlight. And our weird artwork is from my private collection with our quick change um, cleat system that allowed them to hang the grandfather clock here in the beginning. Oh, and quietly put the paintings and stuff back up. This is the B side of our doors that you never see. And the A side here that fits in to the alcove and the other pieces. And uh, this is as good as I fixed up the line. This is sort of just some paint on top of that rough construction adhesive repair job. Um, I did construct a wooden base and glue that inside. For example, this one is real bad. He's missing the entire um, sort of surrounding uh, sculpt base on top of the wood base. But we painted that out black and you never noticed. They're just kind of in a spot where um, they can be fixed up further for a different show in the future. That could be added and the face can be molded and put on the other. The casting can be put on the other one. And um, But for now, they're going to go down to the basement and hang out. Our trucks will stay um, intact and some of these other components. And it, the boxes won't go down to nothing. And we might even keep the lower stairs if they can be carried through the hole in the floor. Um, we may or may not take the wheels off of them, but it's a nice um, kind of concise and usable piece for like things like the theater elective and stuff that do a play that's not a musical um and they build their own sets and stuff but the, the theater class when they do that show use a lot of pre-existing stuff and kind of scab it together to create a set for their show which is a great starting point for students rather than from scratch um so you know this piece here will have to be torn all the way down to nothing along with the other one oh and our and our rock wall our paper and spray glue kind of either rock or um, dirt or whatever, but it had some great texture you could see in some of the final photos. I'll put, uh, I think the link to my portfolio stuff is always in my video description, but if you want to see the beauty photos of this stuff, go on and uh, through that link and check the those, uh, those photos out. And from other shows too, I've got beauty photos from all the theater productions I've constructed, so. And, uh, oh, and the, the torture, torture rack kind of, we had a, um, a helper paint in all of the, the wood grain and I threw some decoration and stuff on there everything from big rat traps to and cleaver and kerosene jug I had just gotten from a friend um, this is the type of thing I had to paint it, you'd paint it to look like a separate 12 by 12 laying horizontally on top of this 12 by 12 going up those are just some like little semantics I was super grateful to have somebody come and do all of the wood grain painting and it looks fantastic it's perfect um, quality theater scenic painting uh, it's just that last piece of the puzzle is sort of remembering how things are constructed and the stonework is this by the same person really nice job um, not quite contrasty enough to read it's sort of 75% um, finished and we just got that done in time for opening night so this is the type of thing these are the concessions that get made um, it looked great could it look better 
sure could this all this brown get more dry brush could we have you know built an opening and and had some logs in there you know could we have this could we have that could we have this could we have that yeah i don't ever stop i don't stop that's why we have wet paint because i don't stop until it's time for the show there's always more you could do so um but i'm always really pleased on the other hand with what we do get done so that's how you do it and uh thanks for watching we'll see you